Welcome to your channel. Here in this video, we're going to go over uh, explain why you might be losing brake fluid. So, if you're losing brake fluid, um, that can be very critical and dangerous because if you lose a lot of it, you're going to not have any braking power. So, it's normal for the brake fluid reservoir to drop a little bit as your brake pads wear because the piston moves out and in the back it feels, uh, gets filled with brake fluid. So, it's a it's okay but you shouldn't really be going below the minimum level on the reservoir if you're going below the minimum even if your brake pads are worn front and back you should be right at the minimum uh, once you replace the pads the piston get pushed up the level actually comes up but if you keep losing if you put uh, brake fluid and you're losing it the first thing that you need to do is you want to check under the car check the lines and uh, see if you see any drip oil drips on the ground I'm going to show you one vehicle is losing brake fluid and if you look carefully here you can see a brake fluid right here but it's actually leaking from the piston this is the piston that pushes the brakes out and uh, normally if there's no leak at all what we do the piston will move out it will fill the back of that room there chamber with brake fluid and that's why the level of the brake brake fluid reservoir will go to the minimum as more fluid comes in here but if you're losing fluid, like in this case, this rubber is actually filled with brake fluid and it's actually pressurized. There should be no brake fluid there. Brake fluid should not leak out uh, outside through the seals. This is the piston that pushes the brakes out. But you can see that if, if, we, if we move this or if you look down there, you have all that leak and that's not normal. That brake uh, caliper, this needs to be replaced. If you want to drive a car like this, definitely don't drive if your brake light is on on the dash. Thank you for watching Mechanic, where you can be the mechanic.